Uh, we now know that uh, Leonard Leo, the guy who uh, uh, managed to get a, a wealthy billionaire to leave him over a billion dollars that he is now spreading around the right wingosphere, uh, Leonard Leo, the uh, uber Catholic, um, who has been coordinating the Supreme Court stuff and coordinating all the anti-abortion stuff and, and had recommended Brett Kavanaugh, Neil Gorsuch, and a Amy Coney Barrett to Donald Trump as people to put on the court to overturn Roe v. Wade, and of course he was right, um, that he actually back uh, a couple of years ago launched a 1.7 years ago, launched a $1.8 million advertising campaign designed to flatter Clarence Thomas to boost his uh, image. Uh, it included a film about how wonderful Clarence Thomas is, uh, websites uh, pr proclaiming the wonders and, and uh, uh, talking about what an amazing man Clarence Thomas is, and Twitter, a whole raft of Twitter accounts that are you know, tweeting about what a great guy Clarence Thomas is and how terrible Anita Hill is. It's amazing. One of the Twitter accounts, Justice Thomas, the most open and personable of justices, intimate in sharing his feelings, easily moved to laughter. It's from one of the fanboy accounts, right? Um, this campaign was run seven years ago by an attorney by the name of Mark Paoletta, uh, who later served in the White House under Donald Trump. Surprise, surprise. So, you know, there you go.